It's only singles tonight. Oh, well, you could uh, pitch us as a success story, eh? Yeah, I mean, just claim that you got us together. What are you talking about claim? You two would never have sorted yourselves out if it wasn't for me. <laughs> All right, you can stay, but not too much of that canoodling thing. OK. Oh, be still my beating heart. Tonight's going to be a hit. I didn't realise it was a functional. Oh, no, nothing serious. It's just a do. Come on, take a seat. No, I just came in for a quick bite. Oh, well, I'll give you one on the house. A meal, I mean. Why? Oh, because I'm so happy to see you out and about. Come on. I was hoping for something a little bit more private. Oh, no, 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 no. The best place to hide out is in the open. <laughs> Mark Brennan gets a free meal and all the drinks he wants. <laughs> now, yeah, you don't have to tempt me. You don't have to say anything. You just have to sit there and look gorgeous. Oh, and drink. I feel really bad about going out when Bailey's in trouble. Relax, it's a good idea. What? Palming my family crisis off on my boyfriend. If Mason were here, he'd be talking to Bailey and Josh would be a good substitute for Mason, all right? Am I hallucinating? Or is that Mark Brennan? <laughs> yes, that's Mark Brennan. It's a sign. From who? I don't know. From the universe. God, Buddha, who cares? He's here and I'm here in this dress and I really need to go talk to him. Uh, what? Who am I supposed to talk to? Uh, Daniel, would you please keep Amber company uh, for me? Thank you. Yeah, Amber, you're here. How awesome is that? Yeah, awesome.